Hi guys! Want to get the hidden features of InstaFlow? Like voice message speed changer, pinch to zoom, and music on profile. So keep on watching. So iOS emojis won't be included in this tutorial. You can watch it on the previous tutorial. Find this video on my channel. In this tutorial, we will focus on the hidden features. Now open link on description. Download and install InstaFlow app first. Now let's open the app. Log into your account first. And here's the first feature. And here's the quick reply reactions. But you can customize that emoji here. Then choose the emoji. So to activate that, long press home icon first. Then search for custom EQ or picker. Then activate it. And restart app to save. Now here's the second feature. Once you play a voice message, you can change its speed. It's like the messenger feature. To turn on that feature, go to home icon first. Then search for voice MSG. And turn on all of these buttons. Then restart app. Now try to create a story. Here's the third feature. You can trim out and choose any segment of a video. Again, go to developer options. Search for stories video trimmer. Then turn on that button. Then restart app again. Then for the next feature, go to Reels. Do you wonder how to pause a reel? When tapping it, it will meet of and mute the video. But try to long press screen and that would pause the video. See, long press to pause. Long press home icon and go to developer options. Then search for clips persistent pause. Turn on these two buttons. Then restart the app. Next feature. Pinch stories to zoom them. Same process. Long press home. Search for stories pinch to zoom. Then turn on these buttons. Restart app to solve the changes. Now the last feature. Go to edit profile left go add music option. Choose a music you want to use. You can also add more text and emojis. But in my case, it always says error. But maybe try to use the ABPN or use 
other server. Note, Music Feature Elite works for Kassim devices. To turn it on, go to Developer Options. Then search for Music on Profile. Then turn on all these buttons. Then restart app. And that's it.